Hey guys, welcome to Eastwood Homes Video Tours with Nate Daniel. Today we're at the Hampton Woods community in East Charlotte in the university area, just about 25 minutes from Uptown Charlotte, taking a tour of a beautiful new model home of our Davidson plan. Starting inside today since it's raining outside and I can't wait to show you all the new features that Eastwood's come out for 2023. First off, check this out. A beautiful new Cosmo fireplace with shiplap options, new mantle design. This would normally come in white and you can paint it yourself, of course. Have a nice accent wall for your brand new home. Look at that gorgeous fire. So we pan around, this is the Davidson with the alternate style kitchen, which elongates the kitchen, gives it a butler's pantry, a walk-in pantry, and it lengthens from one, sorry, from two to one large, Formal room here at the front. We're temporarily using this as an office. This would be perfect for an eight place setting dining room. Look at the foyer. Nice tree ceiling. The transom is going to be included up top since so we include a nine foot ceiling for your main floor. Oh, that's one of the new touch screens we include. In this kitchen, great. Big island. This shows off our Aristocraft white cabinets and the white Mykonos quartz countertops. Undermounted stainless steel sink. Some of our great Frigidaire gallery line appliances. Check out this huge five burner cooktop. A nice microwave over oven. If you get this particular style, this does become an oven as well. It's a convection oven and a microwave, so we consider it a dual oven. It even does air fry. Ooh, Beltless Pantry, they upgraded to have a cute little wine fridge. All the under cabinet lights, loving it. Big walk-in pantry. Of course, we're using it for our storage stuff right now. When you come into one of our sales centers, you're going to have these new touch screens to give you interactive floor plans, site maps, and a lot of more information about the company and community and area. As you come around to the other side of the family room, you're gonna have a downstairs guest suite. Features a nice little closet here and direct access. Oops, it's locked. Direct access to this full bathroom. You can do this with a tub, a shower. It comes with this plastic insert. This is our basic shower door. We do offer tile full walls. We have semi frameless glass options to really decorate that up. We even have ones that can have built-in seats. Hi guys, good to see you. Great mudroom design. They've done two enhancements to this mudroom. They added the drop zone space and they added the little closet over here. So since this is an option, you can have more drop zone space. Another option, you could add a full powder room here. So if you had someone staying full time in the guest suite and they wanted to keep that bathroom private, you could add a powder room in this design. Or if you wanted to have your laundry room downstairs, you can actually have laundry connections put in here. If you don't have any of the additions to the side, we do offer a window for this wall. This would be access to your extended length garage we have i believe a 22 to 23 foot long garage included on the davidson it has this cool little storage area sorry for the mess all right now we get to go check out the upstairs so this is our new composite flooring isn't this flooring beautiful i'm gonna figure out what color that is if i see any of the colors in here and i don't know the names right away i'll go ahead and put it in the description below the video We got the open railing up here as well. Big open loft. And one of the things I love most about the Davidson plan is all of the bedrooms, none of them come out to a hallway. You've got direct access to the big open loft space. We've got a huge laundry room. There's even space for lots of extra cabinets, even a sink. One of the alternate options if you're building this plan from the ground up is to put a door here right into the primary bedroom closet. Over here, they've upgraded what would normally be a hall bath to a Jack and Jill bathroom. And they gave it some extra doors. So 
You've got private sinks on each of these two bedroom sides, and they give it extra door from the hallway in case anyone from the loft wants to join in. Here we are, beautiful big bedroom. Aren't those cute bunk beds just uh, so nice to have? Here's the private access. So that door's an option. This could be a completely private sink unless you wanted to add the access door. Great walk-in closet. Now some of the windows and closet spaces might change based on the exterior elevation for your house. Plenty of space for the toilet and tub, hidden privately between the two bedrooms. It's another private sink. This particular elevation gets a linen closet built in. Sometimes there's a window here, sometimes it's just a blank wall, depending on how the front of the house shapes up. Here's another side of the Jack and Jill bedroom suite. It comes with a French door closet, which actually has about the same amount of rack space as the walk-in closet on the other bedroom. So one of the big upgrades and one of my favorite things about this particular model is they changed the guest suite to have a sitting room instead of the extra bedroom. Normally there'd be an extra door there. If you go look at other Davidson model home videos, you're gonna see a door here in an extra bedroom. However, this one did something extra special I've been talking with with hundreds of my customers in the past. I can't wait to show it to you today. Here is your primary bedroom. That is a king size bed. Lots and lots of space already. We've got the primary luxury shower option shown here. So this bathroom is available to customize with separate tubs and showers of different designs. This is the, called the primary luxury shower. Has a six foot long walk-in shower, built-in seat, built-in ledge, two transom windows, built-in soap cubbies. They did the shower one diverter and rainfall shower head. My favorite thing about the luxury primary shower is not only do you get the split sinks, but you get this really cool linen cabinet built right in. How about that to declutter the bathroom? You get your private water closet. And this is the main closet that comes with the, the Davidson as standard, the way that it's shown. We've got lots and lots of rack space. This is the area where if you wanted a door into the laundry room instead of the cabinet option, you can put that right in there. But check this out. Bedroom four became that sitting room. Well, we went a step further. We gave French doors to that sitting room and the designer had this wonderful idea to make it into a dressing room. Is this not the dressing room of your dreams right here? Let's just take a moment and appreciate the beauty of this. Nice French doors, beautiful closet design. Of course, the designer went a little crazy and showed us what we all could do to our own homes. I don't think that some of the shelving here is an option quite yet. Definitely talk with your designer about that. And isn't it neat that your closet has its own closet? Because this is normally a sitting room. This is just the designer's idea of something you could do with it. This would make a great TV room, great office, great nursery. You can go on and on about the different things, workout rooms. And I've seen this become so many items. I call it the flex room personally, but one of my favorite flexes would be to have your own chandelier and your own dressing room right off of your primary bedroom. Here we are, we're back out into the loft space. Now, you see an extra staircase deck here? There's an optional third floor. This one shows off the third floor bedroom and bath suite. They did a lot more of this open railing, loving that. Normally it'd be half wall caps. Check out what they did, I love the coloring. They kind of softened up, almost like a light pink up here. Oh my gosh, is that one of those egg chairs? It looks so comfortable. Huge amount of space, love the jean jacket wall. What a neat idea. Ensuite bathroom. I love that every bathroom gets the tall sinks, the really nice toilets, but look at all the shelving you get in the shower space. This one also has a great closet. I've got plenty of other videos where I go in through the little crawl door there into the attic. There's lots of storage. It goes down past this hall and then behind that wall for storage area, also where your HVAC system is held. But how neat is all that? All right, let's see the view as we go down the stairs and into the backyard in case you're definitely checking out the Hampton Woods community here in Charlotte, North Carolina. 
I want you to see what one of the example backyards can look like. I believe they even gave us a show with the covered porch. Hampton Woods features 50 foot wide home sites. See a lot of great backyards. Some of them are great and flat. Some of them have little hills. We've got, right now we're in a temporary model home. So this is temporary for us. I love that the rain kind of gave us a little bit of a break. So this is actually gonna be a decorated inventory home. It'll be up for sale pretty soon because when we open up phase two, it's gonna have a much more direct access to 485. So soon enough, this actual home could be for sale. Until then, check us out at eastwoodhomes.com. Search up the Hampton Woods community. Reach out to Michaela, one of our great new home sales specialists. She'll take great care of you. If you're interested in the Davidson plan or any of our other Eastwood Homes communities, definitely check out eastwoodhomes.com. You can click on the little chat bot on the bottom right-hand corner. Automatic chat solves so many questions, and if it ever gets confused, it types one of our six different internet specialists to jump in and help out at a moment's notice. This has been Nate Daniel. My number is 704-369-1634. Such a pleasure doing this video tour with you today. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Thanks so much.